Hey guys, and welcome to Petrol Pet, and welcome to a beautiful sunny day here in the UK. Now, my good friends at Hendy have lent me a moke for a week, and I thought there's only one thing to do when you've got a moke on a beautiful sunny day like today, and that is take it to the beach. So, even better than that, we're going to take it to the beach with the pups and go for a sea swim. It should be fun trying to get the dogs in the back. We are going to strap them in, but what's about to happen should be a lot of fun. Now, th this experiment might go horribly wrong, but look, we're strapped in. <laughs> we have no doors though. A, bit, a little bit worried. We're going to take it really, really easy to start with. Yeah, we've got their wanger. We've got our swimming kit. You going to lie down? What do you reckon? Hmm. Ready for an adventure, Mrs. Petroped? Yep. <laughs> You're going to be dog monitor? Uh, yes. <laughs> Somebody needs to do that job. Hi, <laughs> babies. Are you ready? Are you ready to go? Here we go. It's all go slow. Huh? It's all go slow. Well, so we're in the car that goes go slow. Yeah, I know. This car doesn't do anything other than go slow. You just keep an eye on the girls in the back. <laughs> Should we go to the beach? You concentrate on driving. <laughs> hey, now we haven't had you on the channel for a while. Is that, are uh, you trying to avoid us? What, are you filming? Yeah. Uh huh. <laughs> How are they doing? They're good. <laughs> the nice thing is, we weren't going to go very fast anyway, so. No, it's a good job. So, this is a moat. It's a silly little car. It's a very <laughs> silly little car, but perfect to go to the beach. Yeah. Can you take it on the sand? Uh, it's maybe. I don't think we're allowed to, but. I wasn't meaning today. It was just a question. <laughs> it's only front wheel drive. I know it looks um, like a. I know it looks like a jeep. But the answer to that's no, then. No. So we are off to West Wittering Beach, which is what 15, 20 minute drive, something like that. Yeah. Um, so what we'll do is we'll kind of. Drive slowly on the fast bits of road to make sure the dogs don't freak out. <laughs> uh, well, they're lying down. Oh, are they? Oh, look. Uh, Darcy's laid down. <laughs> Baby dogs! I know, it's quite a bit windy. Where's it? Where's Hilly Bob? Hilly Bob! Hello, Boo Boo! Perfect dog carrier. Yeah. It's not very good for your hair though. <laughs> no soft top's good for any woman's hair. This is true. This one's particularly bad. Yeah, yeah. Oh, I know, I've got an idea. What? Put your hood on? Yeah! yeah. Perfect. <laughs> now I can feel like a real beach bum. It's great. And of course, with you having been dragged up in Cornwall, you are basically a beach bum anyway. Place. Your favourite place in the whole wide world. And when it's sunny like this, we've got to go to the beach. Yeah. How are they doing? Although it's not quite as warm. No. <laughs> Good. Excellent. It's not really a kind of high speed car. Uh, no. It doesn't have, you know, it doesn't really have anything. It's got a radio. Okay. Well, you won't be able to hear it anyway. <laughs> Where's, like, where's the sat nav? Well, you're my Tracy nav. Which way are we going, where's Tracy the, nav? Where's the heated seats? It doesn't have heated seats. <laughs> it doesn't even have doors or That's a roof. Fine. My arm is now acting as a door for Hannah. Oh, is it? <laughs> and I don't fine. have to keep turning around. No, she's fine. I can see her in the ring mirror. She's fine. She's fine. Your, your arm's going to get really tired. Probably, but you know, it's good exercise. So all the pedals, peddlers will want to know how you're keeping. You haven't been on the channel for a while. Good. It's yeah. been a busy old summer. Yeah. But yeah, I'm very good. Can't believe it's nearly the end of August. I know. Which basically means it's going to start getting dark at night, which is not good for me. But anyway. <laughs> <laughs> and as, as far as
as I'm aware, you haven't had to use your speed dial wheel repair man. No. Good, excellent. No. no. Well, I'm not driving that piece of china that you bought because that's just asking to have its wheels. Hold on, so do you like Lady P? Oh, it's very pretty to look at. And? <laughs> I'm not driving it. Why? <laughs> you can drive it? No, it's fine, thanks. I'll drive it if I have to, but. If you have to? Yeah. What, like when you wanted to go to the Cotswold, do you reckon they take the car? Yeah, but taking the dogs in the Mini on the floor was not a great experience for No, them. it's true. It's much better going in the Porsche. Right, we'll stop now. Particularly we'll... as Darcy's out on the seat on the way back, so that's she was? good. She what? Got a blanket. Oh, good. okay, that's all right then. <laughs> <laughs> right, we'll drive through China and we'll put the cameras on when we're nearer the Witterings. Yeah, right, mate? Bloody freezing! <laughs> I didn't. It was sunny when we left home. I didn't yeah. think I'd need a hoodie. No, I need a blanket. <laughs> well, should I put the um, heater on? Oh, I don't think it's got a heater. It doesn't have anything. <laughs> it's all right if it's well. The sun needs to come out from behind those clouds. Yeah. The chances of us swimming are reducing quite rapidly, aren't they? Well, you know, it's probably warmer on the beach. This is true. <laughs> the girls are still doing okay in the back. Darcy's laying down, chilling out. Hallie's sat up, watching everything. It's a bit of blue sky there. Yep, it's a little bit. <laughs> There's another bit over there. <laughs> this was not a forecast. Oh, it's not raining. Shut up. Not raining yet. Here we go. <laughs> I do think bringing your dry rope would have been a really good idea. Yeah, so do I actually. That would have been so cool. <laughs> Could have looked like a right idiot. What, even more of an idiot? Shut up! <laughs> <laughs> so here we go, here we are at the Witching Speech. Now at this point, when we're in the normal car, the girls, can, I don't know whether they can smell the sea or they just kind of know where we are and they kind of get a lot more lively. Uh, not yet, not close So I'm yet. kind of expecting. Ali's like, ooh, hello. The chances of us swimming have reduced a lot. Stop being such a girl. What? <laughs> oh, you're going in here? Yeah. Oh, okay. Well, if you're going in, I'm going in. Okay. Got to. So just, if you are gonna come to the Witterings, by the way, it's a beautiful beach, it's huge. But you do need to book your parking in advance. You need, if you go on their website, there's details. You download an app called Just Park, and then you can book your slot. And that's helped loads this year, isn't it? Because it, normally the traffic in and out of the beach is just horrendous Shocking. in the summer. Yeah. But yeah. actually, because they've got they're phasing when people arrive, it's much much better. At least this is relatively <laughs> solid. <laughs> they've got dogs in the back. <laughs> Well, we need, we need to be able to drive it out to the beach. No. <laughs> get Wrong it, beach. Get it, get it stuck. stuck. <laughs> that wouldn't be good, would it? There'd be a great video then of petrol ped being towed out by tractors. <laughs> I got the moat stuck on Wittering's Beach. Yeah, that would be very cool though, would it? It's not Da-da-da! We're here. All right, ready, girls? How do we get on, dudes? Hallie's shaking with excitement. No, wait, wait, wait. <laughs> Shall we get you out too? Where's your clips? God. <sighs> oh, you can't jump out. No, 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 you can't jump out. Um, oh. Yeah, there we go. Let me touch you. There we go. Da -da -da. We're the beach. <laughs> Yeah. <laughs> Come here. <laughs> so here we are on the Witterings. <laughs> Where's the blue sky gone? It was really hot and sunny at home. And there's quite a breeze and it's a bit chilly to be fair, isn't it? 
bloody freezing. But yeah, so these two never happy when we've got a ball to throw for them. Although Darcy doesn't do much ball chasing right now, but such a beautiful view. We said the tide's kind of about halfway in. When it goes out, it goes out absolutely miles. Um, and when it comes in, there's hardly any beach at all. So today is actually 11 years since gotcha day of this one. After 11 years, believe it. Do well, aren't you, mate? For 11. Go on, let's go. Come on. You go for it, girl. So I think swimming today is going to amount to a dip of the toes. We literally swam here last week and it was beautiful. But a bit cold. <laughs> Embrace your inner whim. Yeah, where's your whim? Hoff. These two. Oh, she's going in. She's going in, people. That means I'm going to go in as well. Damn. Massive big Turner and Hooch dog. <laughs> Go on then, Greasy. This is hardcore. Hardcore. Look at that straight in. Oh, you see, and then this one's just going to go, oh, I want to go in. And this one will be like, no, I'm going to sit on the beach. How is it, Greaves? <laughs> Pretty chilly. <laughs> Now the problem I've got now is all you lot are going to expect me to have to go in as well. Should have bought me a wetsuit. How was that, Greaves? Bracing, but quite coolly, you won't be able to see it, you might be able to hear it. There's a Spitfire doing aerobatics over there. I'm guessing it's probably practicing for a revival, but that's pretty cool when you come out of the sea. So, how was that, Greaves? Very cold. <laughs> it's your favorite thing, that isn't it? <laughs> Just swimming in the sea. Yeah. I need to get some practice because my triathlon in the sea. Yeah, we're going to Marbella, so... It's in Marbella, it's true, it's a bit more state, but... Slowly warming up after our little uh, dip in the, in the ocean. Never, never any better way to start the weekend than a dog walk and a dip in the ocean. But that sounds beautiful. Ready for some mokage? 
That was good fun, wasn't it? See, see, see what <laughs> proper, proper sharp, aren't they? All right, girls. Darcy sat looking out this time. For now, because it's not windy. It's all good. Sorry, the, the perfect buyer for this car is anyone that lives within about 20 to maybe 30 minutes of a beach. What do you reckon? Yeah, I think you kind of be ashamed to not be able to kind of take it down to the sea. Or, or just round town, I guess, be a great city car, wouldn't it? Kind of in the middle of London. Mm. I suppose the, the swinging 60s and stuff, there were loads of mini moats driving around the middle of London. Yeah, but you know, great for kind of going out and doing picnics and just a bit of a fun car. Yeah. As long as it's sunny. <laughs> That's a fairly major prerequisite of taking this out. <laughs> if it's not sunny. Well, I tell you what, it'd do really well in Cornwall around all those little streets. Oh, yeah. Maybe we should take it to Cornwall. It's <laughs> <laughs> the, mm. the thing of the four, can you imagine the on four the back of a trailer? The four and a half hour drive down to Cornwall in one of these, that would be absolutely grim. <laughs> I think that's the cool thing. There's lots of people kind of commented on I know this is the reimagined moak or the new moke. But there's a guy came up and went, oh last time I saw one of them was back in back in the day. It's a long time ago. So is green the colour then? Huh? Green. Green? Mm. Oh, they do them in any colour. Oh. And they do an electric one now. I was going to ask if there was an electric version. Yeah, they do an electric, it doesn't, yeah. Oh, there's one in there somewhere. No, um, it's fine. I didn't realise it didn't have six gears. <laughs> <laughs> so we just tried to get into it. I don't remember six. the last time I drove a car without six gears. So. No, they, so they do an electric one. I think it's got a range of about 80 miles. Okay. Which, let's face it. It's like an electric mini then. Yeah. <laughs> Ooh. <laughs> yeah, the electric mini's got a bit more than that, but yeah. But I guess, if, you know, you probably aren't going to want to do more than 80 miles in one of these, are you? So that's absolutely perfect range, really. But yeah, they do electric one. This has got a little one litre petrol engine in it. It's alright to drive, isn't it? It's quite good it's fun. It's really easy. You don't actually feel like you've got a gearbox. No. Which is pretty good. But it's, it's, um, it's surprisingly good fun when you chuck it into a corner. <laughs> it does have a bit of roll, though. Uh, yeah, and we have two dogs in the back. We do have two dogs in the back. But no, super easy to drive. You're quite limited on gadgets. We have an old kind of radio. That's it, it doesn't have as like, I think you might be able to Bluetooth into it maybe. A couple of speakers. No sat-nav. don't really need a lot though, do you? No, not what really. What do you need sat-nav for? You're not ever going very far. <laughs> You've got a phone with ways on it. So what do you think? It's really fun, really cool. I don't um, think, I mean, I'm not so sure you get any more comments in any car I can think of going to the beach. No. <laughs> you get people take, getting their cameras out and taking pictures. The girls enjoy it, don't you girls? Darcy's loving it, she's just like staring out the, out the um, well I nearly said out the window then, but there isn't actually a window. You right, dude? Well that was fun, I reckon we head home, get a cup of tea, warm up, it's alright for you, you've got a hoodie on. Yeah. Freezing. Go play tennis. I'm going to play tennis, it's an active day today. Anyway, massive thanks to Hendy for letting me play with the moke. There is another moke video coming, so you've got to stay tuned to that. But, this is Petrol Pets, are you going to give it a thumbs up or a thumbs down? Oh no, thumbs up, it's a great play car. It's a great play car. Should we have it as a long-termer? No. no. <laughs> One time a year, it's the end of August. I know, <laughs> they sent it just as the weather starts to get a bit worse. But I hope you enjoyed that one, guys. If you did, give me a thumbs up. Comments below are always welcome. And if you haven't done so already, please subscribe to Petroped for plenty more content to come. But from the moak, with Mrs. Petroped and the pups, I'll see you on the next film, guys. You take care. Bye. Bye. Drive safe.